back to the gold leaf galaxy I go. When it rains, it pours. Yes, that is a true statement. Oh my god, not the clouds! No, not the clouds. Anything but the clouds of rain. Actually, this one is kind of tricky if you don't know how to get past those clouds, because when you fly as a bee, you go pretty slow, and that's kind of a problem, and I gotta get all the way up there to the observation deck, and how do I, oh, how do I get up there? I need myself a bee mushroom. Uh, uh, where do I get one? I forgot. Why is this galaxy not very memorable to me? I don't know. Let's flee. Uh, this is gonna make me go right through the clouds, so that won't work. <laughs> Uh, well, I see a bee mushroom over there, but I know I can't get up... Oh, no. <laughs> now I see. I can't get up there as normal, Mario. And... Oh, wait, I can just get up there like this. What am I thinking? I can take the long way like this. Well, not, not this isn't necessary, necessarily the long way, because um, you're still long jumping around. And uh... Anyway, grab this, and now you'll, you're able to stand on clouds as a bee. Uh, yeah, bees can obviously stand on clouds, evidently, and there's a one-up if you grab that thing if you want it. Uh, okay, now you see, um, that rain on that flower there. If that rain touches you, just like, uh, uh, when you're a bee Mario in water, you touch water, you lose your bee Mario suit, so you fall right through the flowers, and you don't want that to happen, and that's the gimmick of this level, is the bee Mario gimmick, is that you get, you can't lose... Your bee mario -ness. Uh, this one can make me fly up here, isn't it? Yeah, it is. <laughs> um, oh, wait, 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 I see, I see, I see. Maybe I'm supposed to... Oh, there we go. Now I remember. I need to use this to flop up to the clouds. I don't know why. This I remember this galaxy, but for some reason I'm not remembering the stars very much. Don't know why. Uh, I don't know. Maybe it didn't take me that many tries to get them or something like that, and that's why it's not that memorable. I don't know. Well, I gotta be in panic. What can we do? Oh no, a mole is taking over the observation deck. Not the moles. Not the moles again. The moles have caused so much trouble in the universe. That is why we must eradicate them if we can. We got a Starbucks up there if you want to get them. Uh, but what you want to do is fly over to this one here. And yeah, you gotta swing on this thing. Whee! Swing on this thing. I'm a poet and didn't know it. And, a, and see there is wet, wetness on the ground there? That means that there is a cloud that roams along here. Oh, there it is! And you gotta look out for it so you don't lose your Venus. Uh, I don't think there's really a safe spot to avoid that cloud, actually. Um, wait, I'm gonna wait for a cloud to uh, appear and move across. Any day now. Oh, wait, there we go! And now uh, it starts raining. It's like a miniature thunderstorm cloud. Uh... Evidently, a thunderstorm can form in just a couple seconds. That's amazing! Uh, so, then we flop on over here, and now we gotta get over up here. Oh my god, rain! Wait, no, wait, I wanna ride on that, actually. Oh, no, 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 Okay, let's try this again here. Wait for the cloud to form and flop on top of it. Ride that cloud over to this alcove and duck and hide. Otherwise, you're gonna get rained on, and no one wants to be rained on. That's why we carry umbrellas and rain jackets under these conditions. But for some reason in the universe, rain just materializes out of nowhere in small clouds that you wouldn't think rain clouds could form, and uh, this makes a vine appear. Who knew vines would grow so quickly on the rocks once the rocks were uncovered? And there's a mole! Oh no, the moles from Super Mario Sunshine have returned. Okay, what you want to do is fly on top of them. But wait, there's a switch over here. Hit the switch first. Why you want to hit the switch? This is why. Yeah, it makes it a ton easier to get on top of them if you use those things. Ouch! Oh, shooty, shoot, shoot. 
Oh, I lost my B power. It would would be a lot easier to get on top of him if I had my B power. Whoa! If I mean, if I kept my B power in. When, every time you hit him, those uh, he bumps you off for some reason. I don't know how or why. I mean, I wouldn't think glass is that springy of an op obstacle. But anyway, uh, if you lose your B power, you absolutely have to do it the switch way. And I just went in the full circle, didn't I? Because the switch is over here. Dang it! And I, wait, maybe I can do it like this. I'll just see if I can cheat the system. Yes, I can cheat the system. That's a lot better than <laughs> than do it the other way. Oh no, the mole is very ornery. Woo! And spin and kill. Oh no! <laughs> I'm sorry, mole, but I had to take care of you. And there's a star. Dang moles! They ruin my crops. They pop up on body. I mean, I mean on your body. Ah! Oh, everything about the word mole just screams horrible. Well, anyway, the next galaxy I'm going to is the Seaside Galaxy. The star is going after Guppy. Yay! I believe this is a race, if I'm not mistaken. No. Oh yeah, it is a race versus this cute little. Shark, guppy, fish, something, well, whatever. And I'm flying through the air, and this is another one of my favorite galaxies, might add. Nintendo just knows how to make a great beach, I gotta say. Oh no, not the big bully. Don't worry, I'll take care of him. Yes, I will try swimming with a shell. Oh, hey, how's it going, nerdy toad? Oh no, no, there's something freaky. Yes, I know I can dive with Z. What are you telling me for? I've played water levels before. I'm pretty sure they're actually mandatory to get to this point in the, in the game. And I think I talked to everyone, so let's just move on ahead to talk to this toad here. Oh no, that's the hool again. Oh no. Well, Mario knows how to take care of him. Wait, where's my shell? I need it. Oh wait, maybe I'm supposed to get my shell after I start the race with this guy. Uh, yeah, this is gonna be a race. How's it going, shark? Just walk up to him, or I should say swim up to him. Oh no, yes, I am some friend, that kind of, maybe, I don't know, I just met him. Well, uh, oh no, the sea is not yours. I will do it. I will beat you with to a bloody pulp. And by, by bloody pulp, I mean, I need a shell, dang it. Oh, shoot, actually, I, oh no, 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 no. Oh, there's a red shell. Eh, 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 eh. Need to go faster. Oh, there we go. Whew. Maybe I'll be able to catch up. Um, if you don't go fast enough, um, he, those rings disappear and you lose. So, so really, it's not a race so much as it is to keep up with him and just go through rings, I guess. Um, but you still need to be going fast enough to keep up with them. Hence the, hence why I thought uh, of race as my first thought. Uh, he's gonna go towards the right, I think. Oh no, he's gonna go towards the left. That's weird. I thought he went to the right. Oh no, wait, the shorter way is to the right. If you, uh, there, there's a, a race coming up with penguins later on. Uh, minor spoilers there. Um, so that's what made me think of race too. Uh, as you can see, it's not that hard at all to fly through these rings or say swim through these rings. I don't know why I'm saying all sorts of different acronyms for different things. Oh my god! I almost got squished. And uh, I'm going kind of fast here. A little bit too fast, but I think I'll be able to follow him through the last three. Yay! Whee! And the sea urchin even extended its, its spikes with happiness. And now I'll just go up to the surface. Who needs this shell? Just throw it away. What you got to say, huh? What you got to say, huh? Uh-huh, yeah, I'm a land walker, but I kicked your a double ass. Oh, yeah, I spelled it. That means I'm serious. And there is the star. 